How's it going everyone? Colin here. Welcome back to another diecast review. Not review. If you guys want reviews, leave a comment. Diecast unboxing. So today I'm either going to be really excited and hope it's the package I want or be really excited because it's the package I want. I have, I have a couple packages that need to be opened. And I don't know which one's which. Just removing the newspaper. Like I said before, opening the box beforehand, I believe, helps. All right. Oh yeah. Let me hide the name of the car from you. So I might try uploading this one last. And yes. All right. So we got two packages, two cars. One sixty fourth, obviously. Yeah, one twenty four. Um, let me move this one out of the way first. Uh, this one is a throwback scheme. And I just ripped the box, so great going. Whatever, I'm okay with that. Pop this piece out. Oops. Um, I'm not planning on reselling these at, at all, so I'm not too worried. Darlington throwback scheme. You guys guess what it is? It might be in the thumbnail, so get going. It's Darlington, too tough to tame. It's 2019. Darlington scheme. It's Michael and Nuts. Let's see. One out of 361. Nice reflection of me. It's a standard finished official die cast of NASCAR. Let me take it out of the box because I don't know. I like plain white schemes. They honestly look good. Oops. Well, totally forgot about those papers. These ones that fall out. All right. So Michael and that. Oops. Set that there. Uh, is that supposed to be there? I guess. But, uh, yeah, this is his race. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but right there, there's a blemish. Oh, well, I'm, it's not like I'm planning on selling these. I just like the way, look at that. Mm. It says uh, Baby Ruth throwback to, I believe, Jeff Gordon. Uh, Baby Ruth playing up front. White number, red number, or red? Red number one. I like the stripe along the side of the car. Pilot Flying J, his sponsors. Brant. Uh, thank you, Bill Davis. Because Gordon ran for Bill Davis Racing, right? I'm not sure. I'm not an avid Jeff Gordon fan. Uh, free baby Ruth and the app. Pretty awesome. So yeah, this is my first Xfinity one. Uh, 24. 132. Sorry. <laughs> my first uh, Xfinity one twenty thirty two. It's a very nice looking car. However... Let's keep that off for now. What I'm most excited about for this video is this car, which is why I saved it for last. Not this car. Wait, let's look at the DIN number real quick. It was 170. So, not too bad. This car, however, it's going to be a low DIN number no matter which, because it's kind of a rare car. I'm sure, if you look for it, you'll find it easy. And if you really want it, I'm ripping off the paper. Yep, Jamie McMurray. Oh, uh, my first J. 
Jamie McMurray card. Let's look at the box real quick. Nice looking box. 2019. It's his last ride. Number 40. Um, it's number 136. One out of 36. So, I mean, I doubt the value will go up unless he dies. Which is sad, but so honest, right? You might be thinking his last right card. Let me take out that paper. Can't be that rare. They made over a hundred, right? True. However, I got the color chrome car. I mean, I like the way it reflects. It's his last car. One out of twenty-four. And the den on this one is nineteen. So not a bad looking car. Uh, the roof doesn't, the ho hood doesn't go up. The roof flaps do though. Interesting. Um, but yeah, I, I love the color chrome on this car. It makes it pop, really pop. Um, obviously McDonald's and Cessna on his last car. It's, I believe, his only time he ever ran number 40. Uh, he, I think it's considered Chip Ganassi, but I believe it was loaned out by Spire. He uh, wrecked the car in his final start, which kind of stinks, but, you know, what can you do? Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what your favorite out of the two were. Mine is obviously Jamie McMurray, my favorite driver of all time, obviously. I'll see you guys next time.